Hey guys, how's it going? Ben here, and today we are going to be taking a look at my top favorite Mac application so far for 2013. Now, this app is called Bartender, and you can download a free trial for four weeks, or you can purchase it for $15, which is a bit of a steep price point. But the app is just excellent at what it does, and I've been looking for something like this for quite a while now, and I can't believe I haven't stumbled upon it until now. Anyways guys, so what this application is, is it hides everything in your menu bar. Now you'll notice I have these three dots in my menu bar. This is the icon for the application that runs in your menu bar. So we can click this and you'll notice that here I have my clock, my Wi-Fi, and anything that you normally have in your menu bar up here. Now the thing I love about this application is it hides all of the clutter that I would normally have on my menu bar. One thing you might know about me by now is that I like my desktop to be very clean and simple. You'll notice by my dock, nice and clean, simple wallpaper. And this application just has solved that problem for my menu bar. So I'm just going to open it up right here. I'll show you guys just a quick demo. Here we have Fantastical. Everything runs perfectly fine, just as though if you were to have it in your regular menu bar. Now, if we were to click the um, settings tab, we have some things we can select here. I'm just gonna go into the preferences. Now, this is how everything works. Once we're on the menu items tab here, let's say we have Twitter open. Normally, if you guys have the Twitter application, you will have an icon in your menu bar. Now, how this works, uh, right here we can select uh, nothing. Bartender does not do anything to the application. So, in this case, it will still be running as you can see in the menu bar. If we select the second option, um, it will not appear in the menu bar and it will be inside Bartender now, as we can see it's right here. And also we can uh, select completely hide menu bar item. So this item will not appear in your menu bar or the Bartender bar. Now this also works with Apple's default ones. As you can see here, we have the AirPlay, Display, Airport, Battery, Clock, and you'll notice that I have um, the Wi-Fi and the clock right here. In the general tab section, we can also launch Bartender at login, as well as some other options that you might be interested in. In the advanced section, we also have some keyboard shortcuts that we use, which is also very useful. So a great way to use this is if you don't even wanna see the Bartender icon in your menu bar, you can easily make the icon invisible and then use a keyboard shortcut to access it whenever you'd like to. Well guys, that wraps up the review for this application. As always, the link will be in the description below, and I'd highly suggest at least trying out the trial to see if you're really interested into this application. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you all next time.